Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to what will potentially be just a one-off video. So uh, I was very much looking forward to this game. Unfortunately, it came out about a week ago uh, while I was still playing Elden Ring. So finally got a chance to sit down and play it. But uh, yeah, this is like a farming sim slash like JRPG uh, with a lot of RPG elements as well. So uh, I figured I'd just do like a, uh, a quick video on it. Uh, as you can see, I literally haven't loaded anything at all. I, yeah. Uh, I've never played a Rune Factory game before in my life, um, but yeah, I'm keen for it. Uh, apparently we can tame monsters. But yeah, let me know down in the comments as you're watching this, like whether you're interested to see more. Otherwise, I'll just play it on my own time. I am sincerely not fussed. Uh, funnily enough, I'm actually downloading an update to my PS5 at the moment uh, for Elden Ring on PS5. <laughs> I, I have a serious addiction and that is that game. But uh, yeah, I wanted to obviously do something while that was loading and I figured I may as well start this game. Make a bit of a video on it. Uh, and as you can see, there's no webcam. I'm not gonna lie, I look a bit rough today. Uh, probably sound it too. So, all right, the Kingdom of Norad, a forest along the border. Yeah, I don't really know what to expect from this game. I, I from all I've heard is that it's a pretty chill JRPG. So, we're here for a fun time. All right, cute little fox girl. Oh, I should have changed this to Japanese. Oh well, hopefully I can do that after the fact. That's fine. We may as well see what the English voice acting is like. I'll scream. It's a girl. I have to help her. Ah, oh, we can just be male or female. Let's just go male. Usually I actually play female, but I'll, we'll play male. Just the right man in the wrong place. Continue as a male character? Yes. I believe there's like a uh, like marriage element to this game. So, may as well play the dude. Must have blacked out. I can't remember anything. Oh, there is voice acting. Oh, oh, there you go. I don't have to voice it. Alright. Got the cute, cool little, like, Celtic style uh, music. She's getting attacked by, like, a rabbit? A monster. Yeah, it's it's literally a rabbit. Wait, save her. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna bare knuckle box a rabbit. Hell yeah, dude. Okay, I can move around. First need equip weapon. I'll open the okay. Uh uh. Alright, I switch I have to switch back from uh, understanding where the Y and X buttons are. Oh, so there's no lock on system. Thing's name is just Wooly, okay. Cool. So no lock on, but you can use the right stick to move camera. Or maybe there is lock on. I didn't really try to push in the right stick. Trembling girl. Okay. More than just a rabbit now. Oh, he had an ass kicked. Rough. Oh man, it's time to whoop some ass. You gonna teach me some more like combos? Ah, it is going to teach me lock on, and it is the right stick. Cool. Great. Oh, we got uh, dodges, kind of? Right. Okay, there's this bit of a delay between like dodging when you can attack. That's okay. I was wondering if you could like dodge attack or like dash attack. Are you a healer? She looks like she'd be the classic like Miko healer style character. So is it just that our character just kind of like appeared in this forest out of nowhere? Picked up a sword, started kicking some ass. Since it's impossible to fail while upgrading something, you don't have to worry about losing your equipment. Some items have unique effects when used to upgrade something. Okay. High level items like food and medicine will have stronger effects when consumed. There's gonna be a lot for me to learn in this, isn't there? What I do like is it wasn't like some uber long cutscene, it was just like... Boom, straight into it. Get to learn how to battle. Or is this going to be the Ubalon cutscene? I don't know. Very, like, pretty colourful game. Yeah, I really switched to Japanese. Oh well. 
It's gonna be like one of those classic things where it takes like an hour to get access to like my menu. You can do it, Priscilla. I like the name Priscilla. Still scarred from Claymore. We made it. Thank goodness. <laughs> Dies. Roll credits. Your body was used to make the Rune Factory. Hooray! It's gonna be fun going back to playing on. This is on Switch. Uh, so like, having to get used to load times again. Oh. I'll be interested to see how our Elden Ring performs on the PS5. Because a PC performance can be a bit choppy. Sorry, I'll stop talking about Elden Ring. <laughs> That's my bad. Alright, who wakes up with three chicks standing over him? I'll go get my mom. Okay, bye. Oh, and a, a wolf man. Okay. Must have been quite the party. Come on. Murakumo, you scared here in Priscilla. Why is his voice normal? My niece was carried in here. Oh. He's way too happy. Way too energetic. Why do we have a hat suddenly? Who gave us this hat? You can let me access the menu, my dude. Or just... Let me... I'm not going to finish that sentence. Oh, we already found Basco. That's good. It only took seven minutes. Not bad at all. Oh, it's her mom? God damn. Doctor and Mayor. Quite the talented lady we got here. Uh, so many things. Fire away, what is your name and birthday? Shit. Wait, the character's name is just Ares? That's pretty good. I like that. Normally I use Link. Uh, we have room for eight. I don't think we can fit. Definitely can't fit Shadow Link. Damn it. Alright, that works. Uh, oh, I like how it's a holiday instead of uh, Saturday or Sunday. It's holiday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Uh, let's get 22nd. Is spring? Sure. Whatever. That is not my birthday, obviously, by the way. I did not want to put that information in. SP22. Well, I, uh, do I have to pick a hometown? Like, how does that come out of? I'm really sorry. Alright, we got the amnesia. This is madness. This is madness. <laughs> yes. hey. I really hope she takes off her eye patch at some point and it just has this un unimaginable power, like the classic anime what trope. Alright, you can give me a house, let me build a farm. I should leave before I cause any more trouble. <laughs> it's like, alright, peace. Back to the forest we go. I better be on my way now. Nah, I think I'm good. I'm gonna go with the pink hair chick. Is that fine? That's Actually, I guess there's two of them, but... Yes! I mean... <clears throat> That is most unfortunate. For his own safety, of course, and for science. That's fine. Uh, wait. I was like, man, can I move yet? No. Rough. Um, Not following, like, any of this. They're all fighting over you, dude. Roll with it. Honestly. Inviting a total stranger into your homes. I don't like this chick. She's too suspicious. He's a wolf in Wooly's clothing. You have a literal wolf behind you. Mm -hmm. My daughter does raise a valid concern. I mean, I am carrying a broadsword. 
take to the field captain's office. The soul sphere doesn't lie. Once again, will tell us what kind of person he is. Hey, okay. I really have a lie detector. Exactly. You raised it, now you gotta deal with it. Uh, really? Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Well, we're going with the pink haired one anyway. Aha, uh -huh, you missed out. Hey. Such a son. It's been a while since I played a friggin' weeb game. I see. Of course, the field captain's a tiny girl. Why wouldn't it be? Captain Olivia. Excuse me? Yeah? I mean, it's only a random amnesiac, dude. No reason to be, uh, told, I guess. I don't know if this is like the other. This wasn't the other playable character, was it? Was it? Um, this child. She runs the silo, seeds, rig bath, outpost. Who's rig bath and what's a seed? Those are my questions. Honestly, this town is called rig bath. It's kept safe from monsters by seed, an organization dedicated to protecting people. All right. The building you're standing in is rig bath outpost, which is also known as the silo. I mean, I appreciate some exposition, so. Roll torn up, so we took the liberty of lending you a seat. That means someone undressed me. Got it? I, I, I understand, but like. No need to thank me. Why would you guys do that? Whatever. So, where did you come from? What brings you to our peculiar little slice of the frontier? I fell from the sky, hit my head, killed a rabbit. Now I'm here. Rosalie has amnesia. Oh. The soul sphere we go, which looks like an arcade machine. With a funny looking crown on it. Hold out your hand towards the crystal. Alright. This thing. Yes. He's just like waving his hand over it. This man is a murderer and a psychopath. Like, oh, good. Zerines are nearly out of control. That can only mean one thing. What did I do? Did I break it? Well, I'd like to know. What gives Phil Captain? That was not a normal reading. Normally the Soul Sphere only gives off a faint glow. Huh? At ease, you two. This one is no threat. That's what you think. No, never mind. Important thing is that nothing suspicious came up on the Soul Sphere. Squeaky clean. Uh, knew this test were unreliable. Soul Sphere is, uh, you know. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't ask questions. Quantifies the inner light of a living spirit, whatever that means. Yeah, the best one is up. Cool. So none of them know what it is. If you don't have anywhere else to go, then I have some work for you. What? Our only active ranger eh, it's all bullshit. So we're a little understaffed. We've had to work overtime or we're well? just volunteers. Yeah, man, the pay better be good. Field Captain! Jesus Christ, man, we're in a mating. Have some goddamn respect. There's a mystery afoot, Captain Livia. Many Yuki's spectacles have been spirited away. Uh, it's not that. They vanish into thin air. It's a serious incident. Huh? Come on, Lucy, hurry! We need to investigate the scene before it's compromised. All right, man. Have fun. Sounded uh, serious. Strange things always happen when Cecil boy detectives around. <laughs> so it qualifies for a mystery out in the sticks. As soon as your memory returns, you can pack up and go, but for now we need all the help we can get. Alright. Yes. Ah. Way to work. Huh? 
Agriculture. Oh, we're gonna learn how to farm? Hell yeah. We're gonna get our farming on. My god, these load times. This is the field. I'm gonna explain how farming works, okay? Uh, please do. Go ahead if you didn't want to listen. Alright, you start by tilling this field for me. Tell the truth, nobody worked this field for ages, so let's clean it up first. A button, pick up all the weeds and branches. Put them in a bin. I think we're Gucci. We done? You hold down the A button, then you'll only pick up items of the same type. Wait, I can- Oh man, I was doing that one by one. The shipping bin when you're holding something, then you can just throw some- Son of a bitch! I received a cheap hoe. I'm not gonna go there. Anything you know what I'm saying? Just ask me for help. I think that's all I can do? Uh, okay. Take some turnip seeds. You can tell I'm a very good farmer. I kept all my shit together. Uh. Alright. Now what? Aw, oh, man. I can't tell you all the shortcuts after you've done everything. The oil dries out overnight to make sure the water seeds are planted every morning. Uh, but not on rainy days. Sure. You can eat whatever you grow as is, or you can cook something with them. Somebody, somebody will come by every day at 8am to collect what's inside, so make sure you put everything you want to sell in there before then. Looking forward to see what you grow. You just gave me turnip seeds. What do you think will grow? Like one of those, uh, what are they called? Earth mates? Excuse me? I feel like you're the kind of person who can make the whole area a green, vibrant place. Enter the earth and bring it to life, filling the world with runes. I always loved reading about them. Runes are, um, they're sort of like a stamina? Maybe a life force. Basically, if you work yourself too hard and use up all your runes, you'll collapse from exhaustion, so be careful. I see. Uh. Okay, well, switch from your weapons and farming tools without opening up the owl. Select buttons. Right. Alright, so we have a room. We know how to farm. It's the second floor room has always been empty and Captain Olivia said that the rangers should live here. She did? Well, at least safety won't be a problem. She's just downstairs after all, as also people come by the silo all the time. If you need any help, feel sure someone will be happy to lend you a hand. Everyone here is always eager to help each other out. A bed, a calendar, and a projector. Why would I need a projector? I want to check the date and see whether a festival or anything is coming up soon. The projector lets you view it. Ah, uh, okay. Rewatch cutscenes, gotcha. What's up with your bed? After you go to sleep, you wake up at 6 a.m. the next day with your HP and RP restored. If you don't sleep enough, you'll become fatigued and also more likely to catch a cold. So make sure you always get a good night's sleep. Um, great work today. Thank you. I tried my hardest. Till the whole thing and plant some seeds. Or we'll get some turnips. I want to talk to this chick one more time. Take it easy and rest well, okay? Right. And this is the save point. Alright, well, I'm gonna end it off here, guys. So as I said, uh, I just wanted to do a quick video on this and like the start of the game. And yeah, let me know down below whether you want to see some more or whether you just rather I stick to some other, like I guess more exciting content not to say that this isn't fun but obviously it's a bit slower and mellow 
But uh, yeah, love to hear your thoughts. And if you enjoy this one, make sure to leave a like. And I'll see you next time. Have a good day.